Hey guys, I'm Zen and welcome back to the basement Dino Dungeon. Today we have some new animal figurines to add to our collection. Okay, check them out. These are actually Kinder Surprise figures of different animals and they are actually very different from our previous Neptune figures. So I think we have quite a number of them. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 12, 14, 16. 16 different animals to be added to our collection. I'm pretty excited. Let's get right into it. Alright guys, so let's begin with the first figure right here. I think I'm going to choose the Orca. So let's open this up. It's a very tiny little figure, but I know that all these Kinder Surprise animal figurines, they are actually quite cool. So let's have a look at them. Pretty excited about them to be honest. So let's get this out. So it comes with a little leaflet as you guys can see. Alright. Okay. It is not from you know the Neptune, so this is probably a different set right here, but pretty cool looking. So let's pop in the body. How do we do this? Just pop it right in. Okay, there you go. Quite a nice Aka figure. So, and this is like a little stand for you to insert to the bottom of um, the figure. Let's see. What's the right direction? I think it's this way. Yep, pretty cool. You can actually move, you know, the back part of the body, the tail right here. So we have an Orcar, which is also known as a killer whale. Very nice, okay? So that's our first figure of the day. Let's have a look at another sea animal. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with um this one, which is probably... No, it's not a sea animal. Let's try to find a... Um, how about this one? A marine mammal which is a polar bear. So let's get this out as well. It's a literal pack right here. So let's get all of them out. Okay, let's see how we can actually fix this. Okay, I think you have to put it this way. Okay, this is basically the front part of the body and this is the back part. Just snap it on. Hmm, that's kind of weird. Okay, let's try this. You have maybe you have to like remove this part first. Let's see. Let's try our best to um, assemble this again. Okay, so yep, that's right, guys. It's the same figure. So have a look at this. Yeah, this is actually from Neptune's. So we, we do have like, you know, one whole box of um, different Kinder Surprise animals. So we can probably do another collection video update sometime because today it's mostly unboxing and we still have quite a few to um, actually resemble. I don't think we have the bald eagle. This is the American bald eagle, I think. So let's have a look. Yep. I don't think we have this. It looks very, very similar, very, very similar to um, the one that we, we have, but I don't think they are the same. They look very, I mean, it looks very different. So it comes with this tail, just pop it right in. Okay, it's not super easy to assemble, to be honest. I have to try this again. Okay, dude, how do we do this? Okay, this one doesn't seem to... Yeah, wrong side. Oh my goodness, Dan, come on. You're better than this. Yeah, it's really hard to hold them um, still. So it's definitely not very, very easy to assemble it. Okay, there you go. Very nice. So you can see, um, what is it holding? Yeah, it's holding on to a fish. Very cool. And you can see the wings are able to flap. So this is an American body girl, I think. Beautiful figure. 
Let's have a look at this. This is probably... Um, let's have a look. It's probably a reindeer. Okay, let's have a look at the leaflet. You know, too bad it doesn't, you know, write its name right here. It doesn't have any names. These are basically like some, some warning. So there's no proper name for this animal. I mean, if they include the name, that will be fantastic. Have a look at this beautiful reindeer. I don't think we have a reindeer in our collection. So this is basically from the giant egg. It's a beautiful gorilla. Uh, let's have a look. I don't think we have a reindeer. We, we have a hare, a rabbit previously. But it's a very different one. But it's okay. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll do this in another video. Yeah, a Kinder Surprise Animals video. Coming soon. Probably on um, Wednesday. So stay tuned. Let's have a look at this. A squirrel. Yep, a squirrel. Well, this squirrel has quite a number of parts. This is basically the legs, I think, or is it the arms? Yeah, it's the arms. Okay, how do we do this? Yeah, let's have a look at the instructions. <laughs> okay, so you have this part and um like this i suppose this is so weird i can't seem to figure it out guys okay i think i've got it Yep, there you go. What is the squirrel holding on to? Can't really tell. Looks like a little plant. Okay, it's able to move the arms, which is kind of cool. Very cute little squirrel. Okay, we still have one, two, three, four, four packs to go. What is this? This is probably a black bear. Let's have a look at the little leaflet. Wow, this bear looks very, very cool. And it seems to be sitting on a chair, a wooden chair. <laughs> I wouldn't call it a chair because, you know, the bear can only be found in the wild. So it's definitely not a chair, but it looks like a chair. <laughs> okay, let's try. Okay, you pop this right in. Followed by the um, the lower body, like this, and now the upper body. Yes, super cute. And it's able to move. You're able to push this, like move it sideways, so it can actually shake its shake it shake its body, which is <laughs> super cute. And yeah, this has got to be the the funniest one in today's video. Very cute, black bear. Okay, next up, I think we have a raccoon. Let's have a look. Yep, a little raccoon. Super adorable. I think this one is the, the easiest one to assemble. You basically have like, just one part for you to just push it right in. Yeah, it should be the easiest, but somehow I'm struggling to <laughs> insert it. Yeah, there you go. Very nice. Oh, it's able to move. Wow, this one is cool. I like this one. You're able to move the tail and the head will actually move along. Super adorable. And it basically sh is shaking its head right here. I think this is a raccoon. I think so. If it's not a raccoon, let me know down below, okay? Okay, what is this? Looks like a, an otter. It's probably an otter. Let's have a look at the little leaflet. Okay, let's have a look. It's a beaver. 
and um, seems to be holding on to some not too sure what it is but seems like a brunch okay let's pop in this first it seems to be quite easy to assemble I think this pot pop it right in and um, this is supposed to be inserted like this inserted into its body very cool seems to be chewing some some steaks I mean branch how does it move let's see oh you're able to move the tail up and down let's try yep there you go chomping down on the branch very very adorable okay our last one of the day guys This one is definitely a fox. Let's have a look. Yep, it's a fox and you're able to move its tail. So for this kind of figures, usually you have to um, resemble one part first, I think. Okay, wait a minute. This one seems to be. Oh dear, how do we do this? I think we assemble this part first. Nope, we assemble these two parts first based on the instructions. Okay, and then you pop it right in. Like this, you snap it in. Yep, took me some time. Um, this is a fox for sure, very very beautiful and uh, what it can do is basically you can turn the tail which is cool okay let's have a round up okay so all of this 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16 figures are pretty unique except for the mountain lion which is the same as our, the previous Neptunes so let's have a look at, um, at all figures again so this is basically a bear very cute can shake his body. Um, we have a Servel. I think this is a Servel. I'm not exactly sure. This is probably a raccoon where you can uh, move the tail. The head will move. This is the um, mountain lion, probably a puma. This is the Okar, which is also known as the killer whale, an apex predator. It's able to move the back of its tail. We have a little turtle. Okay. The turtle, you're able to extend the head and you can push it right back. You can pull it back out again. And um, we have a woodpecker. So the woodpecker, you're able to move this little handle right here, the tail. You move the tail and its beak will just go packing at the tree. And here we have the um, American bald eagle. Okay, so you can press here, the wings will flap, very beautiful. We have a reindeer with a movable head and the antlers are very very beautiful. If I'm not wrong, some of the deers, like you know the white tail buck, they change their antlers every year. Yeah, they drop their antlers and they grow new ones. And this is a crocodile, very cute little crocodile, I like this one the most top three if i'm not wrong the fox looks really good as well very beautiful and um we have our hair right here okay a wild rabbit and we have a chipmunk no i think this is a squirrel okay you're able to move the hand okay right here there's a little handle okay can move this up and down pretty cute the mountain lion i think i've shown you guys right have i M maybe not yet okay raccoon bevo how do we, do i operate the bevo yep the bevo is one of the very cute ones you move the tail up and down it will go into this chomping mode 
and uh, we have the polar bear which you can move the polar bear seems to be from Neptunes as well the kind of uh, the way it functions similarly to the um, Timberwolf yep so this 16 are basically our new collection in our next video I'm gonna I'll probably do a collection video of all the Kinder Surprise animals, okay? You might be wondering what are all these? These are little dinosaur figures which have no, no place to keep, so I'm just keeping um, them with um, the Kinder Surprise animals. So, yep. So, next video, let's go through all of them together. I think that will be super cool. Alright, thanks for watching this. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.